please welcome to Horrible Histories, the four King Georges of the Georgian era with Born to Rule. I took the throne of England just cause I was Protestant, a German prince whose English tank King George number one. I like to argue, now that's clear, especially with my father here. And when he died of diarrhea, I fought with my son. I broke records with my 60 year reign. And I broke the scales with my giant frame. <laughs> Born to rule over you, King George, four, three, one, and two. You had to do what we told you to Just because our blood was blue I was a hunk, girls adored me Ladies all swooned before me They would do anything for me Or I'd have their husbands killed Had a war with Prince Charles Bonnie. Everyone said that I was for funny I spent everyone's money. Our subjects were not thrilled. I was the sad one. And I was the bad one. I was the mad one. And I was the fat one. We were born to rule over you. George's son. Three, four, and two. England's king, though we were drawn to him, then him, then me, then you. We were born to rule over Born to rule. Forged on fruit, sin I died on the loop. People hated us, and we hated them too. Born to rule over you. Born to rule. What's as bucky as a bonkers kangaroo? Ooh. Me, I would have been more at home in a zoo. And now, now our song is through. Yeah. George's Bannon. Horrible history. Anyone who's lived around these parts or ever knew us is well aware that you should never mess with the Tudors. My granddad Henry VII, he beat King Richard. That's him pictured, defeating the type. He liked his name so much that to keep alive his memory, he called his own son Henry. What was he like? Everyone said Henry VIII was a baddie. Even though he was my daddy Just popping out to chop some wives <clears throat> Cause we're Tudors, Britain's biggest Tudors And just like Barrow Tudors, we go with metals foul Tudors, it general be our Tudors At least we're not as rude as Simon Cowell my reign was quite notorious. I liked to hunt and slaughter. But then you had a daughter. Mary was her name. It was a son I wanted, so I divorced her mother. Then wife two had another. A girl, not again. Oi! That's me you're talking about! Tudor, superior to you, Who followed me as ruler? Best not to ask. It must have been my laddie. Yes, sickly little Eddie. Was ill and soon got daddy. Uh. And who came next? Your daughters then took over. First came Bloody Mary. My sister's rule was scary. So all hell me. Judas, us, the, the history books reviewed us. us as nutters and big bruisers who kill and, and cow. I never had an heir, so our reign ended there. We may not have been fair, but, but we, we were never dull. Horrible histories. A gorgeous Georgian lady 
is quite a sight to see. For some splendid beauty tips, pay attention, listen to me. White is beautiful, dear ladies, smear your face with paint of lead. Never mind the lead has made the men who mixed it ill or dead. Take some silk of red or black, cut a circle or a crescent, stick it to your face to cover smallpox scars, it's much more pleasant. Shave your eyebrows clean away, take a trap and catch some mice, make false eyebrows with the mouse skin, stick them on, you'll look so nice. Next you need a monster wig If you want to look real smashing When your wig has reached the roof Then you'll be the height of fashion Decorate your lovely hairpiece Use the feathers of a parrot Add some ribbons, fruit and flowers From your ear then hang a carrot Make your face look soft and chubby Pack your mouth with balls of cork Hang your false teeth in the middle Hope you don't choke when you talk Now you've followed my advice Last of all you need a fan Flutter it oh so demurely Then you're sure to bag your man ah! Horrible Histories I'm a knight I'm a knight And I'm a knight And, and our only aim in life is to fight I'm a knight I'm a knight And I'm a knight we are fighters and our armour's always tight. And these swords aren't light! Rule three, in war we aim to capture other knights alive. Their families pay us lots of dosh so long as they survive. We act like gentlemen and only fight with other gents. A real knight, he would never fight against peasants. Anyway, peasants pong. Ugh. I'm a knight, I'm a knight, and I'm a knight And our only aim in life is to fight I'm a knight, I'm a knight, and I'm a knight When we ride to war with such a splendid sight We are a sight <laughs> Horrible histories My handsome caveman husband is all I hoped he would be. He likes to go out hunting, then I cook it for his tea. I promise to love him forever until he's old and grey. He'll live to the grand age of 30, at which point he'll probably pass away. Oh, but that doesn't mean you stop loving him, cause now you have to prepare a very to show how much you care for your caveman love. First I set fire to my husband, then carefully cut off his skin. Then boil in a pot some oysters and snakes, let the funeral begin. Drop in some limpets and winkles and sprinkles of mouse, toad and true. Then put out the fire with a cauldron and say, to my caveman love Don't. My caveman love Don't. My caveman love Horrible Histories Divorce beheaded and died Divorce beheaded survived 
I'm Henry VIII, I had six sorry wives. Some might say I ruined their lives. Catherine of Aragon was one. She failed to give me a son. I had to ask her for a divorce. That broke up her heart, of course. Young Anne Boleyn, she was two. Had a daughter the best she could do. I said she flirted with some other man and off with the chop went dear Anne. Lovely Jane Seymour was three. The love of a lifetime for me. She gave me a son, little Prince Ed. Then poor old Jane went and dropped dead. Divorced, beheaded and died. Divorced, beheaded, survived. I'm Henry VIII, I had six sorry wives. Some might say I ruined their lives. Anne of Cleves came at four. I fell for the portrait I saw. Then laid eyes on her face and cried, she's a horse. I must have another divorce. Catherine Howard was five. A child of 19, so alive. She flirted with others, no way to behave. The axe sent young Kath to her grave. Mm. Catherine Parr, she was last. By then all my best days were past. I lay on my deathbed, aged just 55. Lucky Catherine, the last stayed alive. I mean, how unfair. Ugh. Divorce, beheaded and died. Divorce, beheaded, survived. I'm Henry VIII, I had six sorry wives. You could say I ruined their lives. <laughs>